We see people proudly saying, "My son is an engineer. My husband, my husband is a doctor. My daughter is a mathematician, and so on." But now we are going to learn about someone who is a doctor, an engineer, and everything. After learning about this all downer, I am sure you will proudly share with everyone about his greatness. He is none other than our God. According to Genesis chapter two, verse seven, he is the first architect of the world. According to Genesis chapter two. Chapter six, from fourteen to sixteen, he had given a perfect engineering plan. According to Genesis chapter two, from twenty-one to twenty-two, and according to Second Kings chapter twenty verse seven, he is also a doctor. And according to Psalms chapter one forty-seven verse four, he is the only one who counts the number of the stars and calls them all by name. And so he is the greatest mathematician, greatest of all intellectuals, isn't he? Shouldn't we feel great and proud to be the children of such a great power? Yes, we should, and he is the one who has made this entire universe for us. He is the one who so loved us that he sent his begotten Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish and have eternal life. So let us believe him, and in his death, resurrection, and his second coming. Only by living according to according to his will, we will escape from his wrath and gain his promise. This is about the real all-rounder. Let's pray and close this message.